Yo, what's up everybody? Welcome back to another Assassin's Creed Mirage where we left off before um, we got in touch with an old friend, Kong and Kong uh, apparently has uh, a tea business that's been impacted by some nefarious groups of people that are belonging to the order uh and it looks like in that area a lot of businesses and merchants have been suffering because the order has been stopping shipments coming in and out based upon favors or, or you know giving preferential treatment basically so now we're trying to work our way in to this auction apparently and this auction is going to have uh one of the main leaders of the order who's responsible for this corruption corruption and market so we've been working with uh rebecca on over that side of the area to try to uh infiltrate this group of of, of people who's behind all of this and so you know we're going to see if we can go ahead and uh press forward and try to get close as we can into this to this auction so uh let's continue all right so we're back right so let's see, is there anything that we can change? I'll switch it up a little bit. This doesn't really do anything as far as like, uh, you know, the way the, the character plays, but it is something cool to have. Um, so it looks like we have uh, a new die for our uh, appearance. I don't know if I want to switch it over though. I kind of like the, the die that we use now. So I'm going to just keep it as is. All right. So let's see. What do we have left to do? I need to go back into the investigation. All right. So we've killed this guy. Closed out this case for Kong. Uh, so now... We need to track this. Investigate the threats in Bazaar. All right, so we need to pick up some more clues. So let's go ahead and track that. Let's see if we can make some progress with that. Uh, the objective is pretty close. Man, it's a busy market in here. A lot of people. Man, it's really cool how this game has incorporated all these different NPC characters and stuff like that. Um, really do give a a good environment. How about we take a walk instead? This is taking too long. I have somewhere hmm. to be. And this is hardly worth the coin they pay me. Cut off the finger. No coin, no safety. You know this. Or we can just take your perfume as payment. Assalamu alaikum. This is not your concern. Move along. Maybe this can free your time. Hmm. Perhaps it can. We have worked hard, man. Time for a rest. What? Wait. Thank you, Saeed. All right. Gave up a coin. Let me talk to her. Let me what see what she's talking about. What did you do to incur such aggression from the guards? I did nothing. I... I'm only short of coin. Business is business, but I do not have the means to pay their tax. Are your wares moving slow? No, but in recent times, they have increased the coin requested. Therein lies the trouble. Not just for you, but for others as well. Mostly for people like us who are not from here, or not of the same faith. We find it's hard to feel safe in Kach. I have a shipment that's late. I fear my goods and camels might have been seized by the guards. They should have arrived with some merchants bound for the direct Amal. If I could ask a favor, my friend, please look for them. Very well. They should be along the road that leads to the south gate of Baghdad. Ah, I might catch them at the watering hole along the southern road. Thank you, Saidi. The road beyond the south of Baghdad. I should see if I can find those stranded merchants. Okay. 
I'm going to pause this game real quick. There's a couple of things I need to change. I had to do an update on this game, and the update has kind of like modified some of the settings that I already had in place. That was uh, making it easier for me to record. So I'll be back in just a second, and we'll continue with the mission. All right. Sorry about that. We're back. All right. So let's find the stranded merchants to the south of the city. The merchants are stranded near a watering hole south of Baghdad. All right. So let's head this way. Oh, shit. We can't go this way. Uh, let's, or maybe we can. We just have to be careful about it. Uh, nah, let's just go around. We'll just go around. It's kind of funny how this game just allows you to just steal constantly over and over and over again. Uh, yeah, it's kind of interesting. I think I read online where it says that, you know, it's to your benefit to hijack or steal or pickpocket. I don't know. I just, I just don't like the this the story where it's like there's this guy that's supposed to be helping everybody, uh, trying to give them freedom, but they're they're stealing. Like I don't I don't really get that. Um. So I don't know. I've elected not to. To steal, unless it benefits me in some kind of way or another to complete the mission. Like the little artifacts and stuff like that that I can get. Oh, shit. Stop right there. Oh, Jesus. Just, just go. <laughs> you have no business here. You have no business here. <laughs> So let's 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 uh let's get on our camel. Gotta make the trip a lot easier. <laughs> yeah, I, I get like probably like stealing from like the the elites or whatever, you know, kind of like a Robin Hood type story. Um, you know, take from the rich, give to the poor, but because it's, it's kind of in line with the uh, the character's uh, motivations. But just to be stealing from just normal people that's just walking around, minding their business. The merchants should be down this road. Perhaps near a ridge for shelter. All right, let's so use in Keto. That camp must be where the merchants are. Yeah! All right, so we just picked up that clue using in Keto. Oh, look at that little deer. And just like the description says, it's near a watering hole, which is where this this is. Uh, I don't really see anybody around this area. There's a lot of camels out here. Let me get off. Who goes? I come. Assalamu alaikum. I was sent by a friend of yours who was worried for your safety. As you can tell from the horse's head, she was right to be. We do not know what to make of this. Let me help. Perhaps I can find out what happened. We would be grateful. The culprit must have left a clue. Footprints. And right. a blood trail. The horse's head was carried to the center of the camp. Oh, Jesus. My sweet legume. What the oh, hell? Who would do such a terrible king. deed? Do not cast your must eyes on me. I did blade. no such evil. Kind of reminds me of this, uh, remember the, well, let me talk to him before I carry on. Was this your horse? He is claimed by Hades now. Not only do I have to worry about Baghdad's ridiculous thirst for coin, now I must be concerned about my livestock. Malaka. <sighs> Rest in peace, Legum. Mm. All right, so that's kind of helped us out as far as an investigation. Um, let me go talk to this person. See what they got to say. What happened here? It happened in the dark of night. I could not see well, but I saw someone. I think 
I cannot be sure. Okay, so that helped with the investigation. They saw somebody come and cut the horse's head off, but they can't be sure who it was. Um, let's see. You use eagle vision. See if there's anything else highlighted. Oh, there's a chest over there. Let me get this chest real quick. Yeah, y'all gonna have to pay me to do this, you know? I don't work for free. Uh, let's see what else we, we can find in this area. Is that a note or something? What does this say? I think I know what happened. All right, so let's go back to the lead merchant. Let's see what Bassam has figured out. What I was going to say was, before I talked to him, I was going to say this this severed horse head kind of reminds me of the, the movie uh, The Godfather, where the guy wakes up in the middle of the night with his beloved horse head chopped off. That kind of reminds me of that. Um, yeah, savagery. Let me see what he got to say. This is a work of intimidation. Someone is trying to prevent your arrival. La, uh, who? Who would do such a thing? I have no enemies, no bad blood. There could be worse fates if you continue down the road. Let me escort your crew to the gates. You would do that for us? Shukran, God bless you. Quickly, get us away from here. Let us move. The city is not too far. Come, we should leave this place, quickly. Should have stayed home. Hmm. Where is home? I come from a place called Greece. West from here across the water. With my horse Legum, we carried goods to and from Baghdad. All the cities we visited. Al Quds, Basra, and even Tomara. Alright, I imagine we're probably gonna get attacked along the way, which is okay, I guess. Because whoever comes up against Your us, they're going to be meeting our blade. His goods are bound for the Da'irat al-Mal. Nay, the great auction is a big event, and that meant bigger demands. So you are attending then? Attending? <laughs> I only wish I had the coin to spend. No, we are just providing stock for the preparations. Look at a little deer. Oh, shit. All right. Who sent you? Yeah, who sent you? What the hell? Is they went right past us. Come on, man. Come on. Oh, my God. What happened to my parry? Be better. Oh, man. Spineless car, face your face. Well, I didn't use that correctly. There is no escape. Pathetic. All right, hold on. There we go. It was a good idea to get that armor-piercing uh, daggers. Let me see if I can collect more. Man, that fight was a little bit harder than what I expected, man. I don't know why, but for some reason or another, my parries weren't parrying. Uh, where's my camel? Do not stray from me. I think my camel dipped. Where you at, Blair? Camel way over there. Scary ass. All right, come on. Where are the you gods going? report to someone called Al Hanka. This confirms my suspicions. Good heavens. Could they have been sent to kill us? Likely. This is not surprising. We've been vocal against the Khilafah and unfair taxes. It can cost us our heads. 
that the Silent Sheep is an ally to corruption. They do not like this opposition. I would not be surprised if they made an example out of us to others who might try the same. The guy that's talking doesn't sound Arabic. He sounds more like... Baghdad, you are safer now. You are wonderful. Thank you. He sounds like he has a different accent. Uh, all right, let me get off so I can talk to him. Here we are. A thousand thanks, Ya Sayyidi. Baghdad is not safe. Rumors swirl through the markets of merchants dragged from their stalls. Have you heard of such injustice? Who would do this? Rumors say they target the Dimiyun, traders who are not from here. The Abbasids want a stake in all businesses. As long as there is coin, lives are secondary. The note dropped by the guards was from someone called al -Anka. This person is the one behind the attack. Hmm. I overheard the guards refer to the tax collector as al -Anka, Which was odd. Because is the al not female? Tell me his name and where I can find him. Suhail lives in a mansion west of Karkh. Be careful, friend. I doubt he works alone. Thank you, friend. Wafaqaq Allah. The tax collector. He collecting taxes, all right. He's shaking people down. All right. So this is our target. But in order to get to him, we need to investigate tax collector's mansion so we can find his whereabouts. Um... Or is it? Um, I think I need to do that first before I go over here. It was weird because they they had this track. But I guess this is all kind of going in the same direction. So let's just do that. It's all going to the same thing. All right, so... Uh, how do I make my way? Okay, I gotta go through town. I really don't need this this camel at this point. I don't like riding a camel through the town. It's very clunky, you know? Uh, I could always call him back. Let me get something to eat, because, man, I was, I was struggling with that fight. Let me see if I can also find uh, somebody to buy some more health elixir from. All right, let me go. Ooh, there's a shard. I should go and get that. I should go and get a that. A Thabin member is near. They're right over there too. And they're looking at me. And they surround it. Yeah, they surround it. Can I get it without them seeing it? Probably not. I don't care. I, I need that shard. I can assassinate him, but then that would alert the person I need to get the shard from. Oh. Bruh, I'm just walking. I'm not doing anything. All right. Uh, what should I do? About to use one of these smoke bombs. What's going? Yeah. Give me that shard. That shard brings me one step closer to uncovering the mysteries of the chamber. There we go. All right, we got the shard. So now I need to go. Oh, I need to talk to you. Need to get some more elixir. Be welcome, sir. 
All right, let me view your shot. What have you got today? Please have a look around. Uh, quick refill on everything. Then I'll go ahead and sell all my stuff. Trying to make some of my money back. Nothing else? Nope, we good. I must be on my way. So long. All right, I think we good. Dang, there's another uh, thing I can get. Let's see if I can get that. Somebody spotted me too. Shit. Everybody panicking. This is the place. I should not have revealed myself. Ah, oh, bro, I didn't reveal nothing. All right, hold on. Let me get rid of these people. Let me get rid of these people. I'm just stay in here for a second. Wait for everything to cool down. All right, they're looking for me. All right, you guys, just go ahead and give up. You're not gonna find me. I'm gone. I'm in the wind. All right, I got enough artifacts to get a uh, get a reward from Dervis, but I'll do that later. All right, I think we good. All right, so we need to go a little bit closer to the location. So I'm gonna make my way over there. Get closer to his mansion. Scale this wall. Head up top here. Um, make my way over here. It's funny because the way they, uh, the way the cutscene went just now, it made it seem like we were already at the location, but it doesn't look like we were. All right, so here's the here's the location. Let me look around because it look yeah. I think if I go any further up, it's going to say that. Yeah, I'm in a restricted area. I thought so. All right, I hate to do this to Enkido because I think there's probably be another marksman somewhere, but we won't know unless we throw it, throw him up there. I need your help, my friend. Yep, I thought so. Not the warmest of receptions. There he is, though. I see him. Oh shoot! All right, let me. The tax collector is due a visit. Go in peace. Live long enough, war. What? That was supposed to kill him. Ah, uh, that was supposed to kill him. I blocked you. And I caught the horse. Blood will flow. There we go. I meant to use the uh I meant to use that, but that'll work too. Alright, my health is full, so we good. Man, I'm surprised that uh second assassination kill didn't work. Yeah, there's somebody over here. 
See if I can take care of him. Show yourself. I know yourself. Who? Yeah, come on over here. Fought. Is he not gonna come over here? Oh, that's weird. Normally they just come over. Let me scoop scoot up. Perhaps he'll come over this way. Who? I will cut you. Well, oh, come on over here and cut me down. Damn, he won't do it. Alright. Uh there's a dude over there. Maybe if I cut across to the other grass and get behind him, pause, then take him down that way. Let's see. Hey, I'm to get point. I knew it. Ah, oh, shoot. I'm to finish you off. Oh, I've got all Ah shit. There we go. Let me see if I can collect my Can I collect my uh Damn it. I'm supposed to be able to collect my knives back. Cause I am out of knives. Or daggers is what they're they're called. All right, so I took care of that guy. Let's see. Um, there's a guy with a key. Let me see if I can go over there and get him. got to get up and close and get him since I don't have any more daggers. There we go. We got the key now. What is this over here also? Thought it was something I could pick up. Let me see if I can take care of uh, the marksman as well. Oh wait, hold on. There's a note over here before I go and do that. Part of my investigation. The blockade at the harbor is funded by the coin of the people. There might be more information I can find around here. All right. Let's see if I can make it up top. Take care of this guy. Uh, there we go. All right, some more uh, throwing knives. Take care of this dude over here. Fate calls. And Kidu can explore safely now. Oh, they say ammo is full. Okay. Um. Go ahead and take care of him. Get some more ammo. Alright. So I now need to investigate further. Try to find more information. 
There's something highlighted down there. Oh, those are daggers. They training over there. Um, I probably need to go inside of a room or something. That room looks promising. I'm gonna go and kill these guys over here because I feel like maybe there's something useful that I can get over here. You think Nabil will win the wrestling again this year? He's getting older. And have you seen the guy from Al Sham's shoulders? <whistles> Let's not let our guard down. On? There we go. Um, gonna eat me something. Replenish my health. See if I can get him to come over here. Hey, what's going on? <laughs> How the mighty have fallen. Huh? Who's the <laughs> star? Hey, what? Rest. There we go. Pick up some more of these. Ammos. All right. So this is the only way to get in there. All right, so you gotta go in through that way. All right, let's be careful. There you go. Here we go. Two birds with one stone. Oh, they should be back with the coin. Oh, well, my head will roll if we do not deliver it. How hard is it to shake the coin from these fools? Hmm? Order to increase taxes. India. More China. coin trickling into their hands. No partial. Sounds like there's somebody up above talking to themselves. The taxes have been paid. Oh, damn, we killed a tax collector. <laughs> the tax collector does not work alone. Someone not from Baghdad controls the strings. There is a scent on the letter. Perfume. Rose with iron. Mm. I am done here. Nothing else. Roshan and Rebecca will be waiting back at the bureau. I did not expect us to kill the tax collector. A tax collector. I thought that it was going to be a separate mission. But yeah, we killed him. He dead. He good and dead. <laughs> um, I don't know why that's so funny to me, but like a lot of times, uh, like growing up, old, old heads would uh, sometimes tell you about people that had had died in a you know a long time ago you know they always would say stuff like that like oh yeah you're Richard yeah he dead he good and dead <laughs> like like what is good and dead 
<laughs> I don't know. It's just a little culture humor. But anyway, um, all right. So we got to go back to the bureau to tell Rebecca what what happened. You have to do something. Got to give an update on our mission progression. against the coming frost. That's something I never thought about. Uh, you know, uh, places like this getting really, really cold. I imagine it would, though, because it's kind of like, it's like a desert. So, the further you are away from the sun, the more cold you'll get. The further, the closer you are to the sun, the hotter you'll get. But when the seasons, I guess, like change, like the desert areas, from what I've been told, gets like really, really unbearably cold. Um, which is kind of hard to, to fathom a desert being cold, but it makes sense. Our critical hidden one returns. Finally, you found the path back. What do you have for us? The one we are looking for is a Dimune. Someone out of Baghdad. You are certain? I found proof. They were working with the tax collector and the harbor master. One used the guards to harass and extort coin from the Demune. The other seized goods at the docks. Extortion, I understand. But seizing goods? More objects from these ancient beings they worship? They are looking for a rare hairpin imported from the East Road. It will be up for auction at the Da'irat al-Mal. An official invitation into the auction. Now, we have a way in. Well done. Our target has to be someone connected to both Al-Anga and Al-Kululu. Someone working closely with the officials. Informers heard whispers of the Khalifa's treasurer. In recent times, they have been quite involved in the businesses of Kah. Someone like that will no doubt make an appearance at the Da'irat al-Mal. We should prepare, so I will scout ahead. Meet me near the soup when you're ready. Not a lot is known about this person. Underestimating your opponent is a fool's folly. Worried? I will tread carefully. All right, before we move on, we're going to take a look at the uh, skill tree see what we can unlock i think we've collected yeah quite a few skills all right so let's see we got the airstrike Ooh, slows down time while aiming with the throwing knives in midair nice uh focus capacity added two two additional bars the two additional chunks to the focus bar okay uh what do we got here All right, that's four skill points, though. That's a lot. I mean, I don't know. They they say that the more you collect, the more you'll you'll gain from it. Uh. Hmm. That's beneficial. So basically, what this is is, uh, holding left trigger will snap your aim to an enemy as they detect you. Give me an opportunity to kill them and remain undetected. So I guess like when we're creeping around and we see that somebody uh, sees us, instead of us being worried about who sees us, we can just pull left trigger and it'll it'll bring it back around to us, to the person, and then it'll you know we'll kill them. Uh, attacking enemies easier. Increase vision radius. Okay, so this was three points, right? How often will I do that though? That's cool, but how often will I be jumping from a location and doing airstrikes? Um, I feel like this is gonna benefit me more. So I'm gonna acquire this. And then what other two things we can get? 
And then I'll probably get this as well. I think that'll help us out. So yeah, I think we're good on that regard. Is there anything we can do over here? Did we collect enough to... Hello. Nice to see you. To increase the, uh, the tools. I would like to borrow your wisdom a moment. Take a look. So let's see. I don't think, no, nah, it doesn't look like we have anything that we can upgrade. Cause usually there's like an orange arrow besides, uh, man, we need to collect some more stuff. Ugh, we need to collect more stuff, particularly like it? gears. Yeah, that's it. I am in your debt. Farewell. All right. So, is there any? Nope. No new, new contracts. That's another thing I could do also to upgrade contracts. I have a few of them that I haven't done already. Um. Yeah, that's been completed. I was gonna show you the contracts that I still have left to complete. I got like these three left, which will benefit in some way or another. Let's see. Yeah, that'll give me some uh, some gears. Remain undetected. Yep. Uh, why does that say not? Uh, oh, probably because I was trying to do it at one point and it failed and I just never completed it yeah so I need to probably try to do these contracts and try to get some more of these gears that'll help me upgrade all right well, I'll do that off camera we don't have to do that right now so let's see uh so the next mission is to meet Roshan at the other bureau. So let's head out. There's a chest over there too. I'll pick that up uh, off camera. I don't want to bore uh, you guys with me like grinding for materials. Because I think most people, when they check in to walkthroughs, they really want to see what the story is about and see, like, actual gameplay, not somebody running around collecting stuff. Although they do have channels that focus on where to find stuff, you know. But with this game, you really don't need it because, you know, it's this telling you where it's at. Ooh, another artifact. Let me see if I can get this artifact. Getting to the point, I think that idiot Hamza was at it again this morning. Got it. Someone get him to back right. off. Uh, that's another thing too. I need to to work on going to Dervis and get my reward as well. So we got a lot of stuff that we can do to increase our our skill points and whatnot. Although we are doing pretty good though. The plan is simple. Enter the auction as a merchant wishing to bid on exotic artifacts. We know they want the hairpin, and we know they will be at the auction. They already let it slip through their fingers once. When the hairpin appears, I will watch the crowd and make sure to obtain it. That will secure a meeting with this treasurer. I am fully confident they will bid on it, whatever the cost. Yes. I will gather as much information as I can about this treasurer before the auction starts. For someone in their position, there will be no lack of whispers. The first feather without a head. It is your duty to find the right one. Do not let yourself get distracted. Focus on the mission at hand. It does no one good to linger on things that do not exist. This is real. I understand. Silence is better for the wise. And how much more so for fools. Haban Mubatan.
Do you think we need luck? There is a rot in Karch, treasurer. Property stolen. Merchants extorted. Foreigners tormented. Corruption is rank and everywhere. But you are at its heart. Even now, your poison spreads along the East Road to lands untouched by the Order's venom. I hear you hunger for a hairpin. One up for auction at the Da'irat al-Mal. I will play the rival for your heart's desire and draw you from the shadows. All right. Assassinate the treasurer. Sitting at the top of Kark's well, web of power is the treasurer. In controlling taxes and extorting the merchants of Kark, the treasurer is successfully funding the order of the expense of the people's livelihood. Coveting a rare hairpin from the east, the treasurer seizes the imports of any foreign artifacts at the harbor, causing great distress for various businesses. Having hidden themselves successfully in the shadows, the treasurer identity is known to few. It is time to draw back the veil. Look for intel to expose the treasurer's identity. What is so special about this hairpin? That's what I'm trying to figure out. Like, why why does he want the hairpin? What I mean, whose hair does it belong to? I don't know. Everybody's got their own kicks. All right. I think we fully loaded. Yeah, we fully loaded. I just wanted to check that. So let's uh go ahead and select this. Uh, what? I thought it was already selected, but apparently not. Um, okay. All right. Go down here. Oh wait, hold on. I need to use Lentil. Please don't shoot him down. Do you want your child to know the Quran? Reading and writing? Arithmetic? Alright. So I need to go in that other area over there. Um going to see if Enkidu can find the information for us before we head over there. There's somebody with a key. It's always good to have the key. I'm guessing this is where the auction is going to be held at. Uh, all right. Some soldiers is over there. Um, let's see, it's pointing this way. Not really seeing anything. Maybe we need to get closer in order to, for the information to reveal itself. Just seeing normal people walking around, just doing their thing. So let's get closer. Get closer. Oh, okay, I see. The auction is underneath. <laughs> Will they let me go in? Okay, they ain't tripping. Let me use Eagle Vision. See if I can see anything with that. Passive, liar! Oh. Should have known you would be here, Kong. Oh, uh, look at you. You know me. Come. Do you have any information about the treasurer? Someone who works for the Khilafa. The treasurer? Hmm. I do have something, but you know, it hurts to give precious information for free. What job do you need doing now? 
already know what is on my mind, eh? You see, little Finch, the Dairat Almal is not only an important event for the upper class of Kach, but also for thieves. Did someone take something of yours again? A precious ceramic saucer. Luca has it. He has always been jealous of me. Ah, where do you think it is? I knew I could rely on you, little Finch. You should be able to find it in the crates near his stall. Be right back. Man, he always trying to hustle somebody, man. Like, dude, getting these people out of the, the community will help you. But I guess that's, that's just how people are. Everybody's in it for themselves. All right, let me see if I can get this saucer for him. Oh, I can't go that way, can I? Is he gonna say something? I assume you heard about the commotion. Oh, he ain't down. saying anything. Okay. Oh, not them this time. Another bit of trading. I can get a stall near the auction. This must be the stall Kong mentioned. Now to find that plate. Looks like a flimsy wall that you can tear down. Yeah. Need some explosives though. Oh, what is this over here? Let me move this. Point of moving that. Oh, so I can get up here. All right, let's bring it closer. Yeah. There we go. Oh, I need to take these. Place it right here. Let me see if I can do it safely up here, though. There you go. Huh. Not seeing anything. It just takes us back outside. It's gotta be it. Oh, you know what? I gotta get up there some kind of way. So I gotta bring this over here. Yeah, I can see. You see the grooves on the ground indicate that uh, you need to move it into this area or it was moved out of this area. to own a plate like this. Now maybe he will tell me what he knows about the treasurer. Let's see what mm -hmm. this is. Suspicious activity on the rooftops. Might need to go out on a rooftop just to see what the hell is going on. Can I go up there? Hmm. Let's see. What's going on 
yelling at this rooftop. Let's see. Just want to check this out. Oh, shit. There you go. What? Oh. <laughs> you. Yep, got him. Is that the only thing? Oh, key. Oh, this is where we saw. This is where we saw. Uh, what in Keto? Where I thought I needed to go. So that's where. That's what this is. Okay. I collect this. Collect that. I think there's another chest around here somewhere. Let's see if I can spot the chest. Is it further up? Said there was a chest around here. I think we walk, walk past it. Maybe it's down ground, down below somewhere. <clears throat> yeah, that's what I'm thinking. All right, let's just go back to Kong. Uh, where are we going? Over here, I think. Did we pass Kong? I think we passed Kong. And now I see the other option that we could have went to uh, get information about the treasurer. Well, it's too late now. We already got this, so we don't really need to do that other one. Here, Little Finch delivers once again. Just the very thing I need to complete my set. I thought this was yours. It is now. Anyway, <laughs> listen close. I was having my usual afternoon tea when I overheard two ladies speaking about an order they fulfilled for the Dayadat Al Mal. They made a beautiful robe for the treasure with intricate Eastern embroidery. Open your eyes to that. Eastern wear. Thank you, Kong. The treasurer is likely a foreigner from the East. All right. So let's head over to the merchant stall. What's up there? Come upstairs and look at my words, ya Sadiqi. All right, that sounds kind of suspect, Plur. Come on upstairs and say my words. Here only. Nowhere else. Don't be shy. Come closer and be amazed at my selection upstairs. Assalamu alaikum. You mentioned Chinese artifacts. Yes, friend. Welcome, welcome. You will surely find something of interest here. All right. Beautiful threads. Smooth as a camel's buttered bottom. A special for you. Longing for the exquisite, ya sadiqi. I have ornaments that hail from the Far East on auction. Rare vases, delicate teacups. But the hairpin is my prize. One of a kind. 
a beauty even the treasurer asked about. Wait, the hairpin? Where is it? It's going to be up for auction. If you wish to purchase it, make sure to bring a good bag of coin. A hairpin? From the east? This must be the item El Kululu was after for the treasurer. I must look out for it at the auction. All right. But we already knew that part. So he's the one that has it. All right. So I guess we got to go over to the other uh, clue. I thought we only needed to do one. But it looks like we got to do both. So let's head down. And make our way over to the other, other clue. Because this information... It's good information, but it still doesn't tell tell us who the treasurer who, who the treasurer is. Tardiness is not something the treasurer appreciates. Oh, I got to eavesdrop. You repeat, the treasurer. Not something we can rush. Yes, say that. The treasurer will not be happy. Neither will I. I know that. The perfume creation is complex. We are already doing our best. Your best is not enough. Come, we talk elsewhere. There are ears in the walls. That woman mentioned the treasurer. I should keep my ears close. The treasurer is fond of the Kina, as you know. No one is more unhappy than three dozen bottles go missing. With the harbor withholding our supplies, production has been slow, yes, I doubt you. Certain incidents there have also made our situation difficult. You are not telling me exactly what it is we are missing. The uh, blood, my lady. The blood is essential in the scent. It is what makes the Kina perfume special. We must have it. I will talk to the Halifa. See what we can do. The treasurer will have to wait for her supply. This perfume? On the tax collector's letters? I thought it smelt like iron. Was it blood? This woman could be from the Khalifa's inner circle. She knows the treasurer. I must speak to her. Assalamu alaikum, ya Sayyidati. Wa alaikum assalam. I could not help but overhear, Sayyidati, about the perfume. It is not courteous to eavesdrop. Seeing as you are an admirer, you are pardoned. My name is Kabiha, the woman behind the Kina. It has a unique scent. Rose, honey, sandalwood. And if you heard, a sliver of blood. Blood? I should have guessed. I had thought it might be iron. Blood is born from iron, is it not? But, because of that detail, it proves difficult to bring in large quantities. If it is so exclusive, it must be popular amongst officials. I think I caught a scent of it near the treasurer. Ning uses the Kina. She is quite taken with its rich mystique, as are many. Curious. You do not look like one who is interested in the art of perfumery. It is unwise to judge someone by how they look. Indeed. Did I not catch your name? Basim. Basim. I must not waste any more of your time. I wish you a wonderful time at the Da'irat al-Mal, ya Sayyidati. Hmm. So, the treasurer is a she. And her name is Ning. The auction should be starting soon. All right, let's head on into the auction. 
So that makes sense that the uh, it would be a a female, considering they're obsessed about this hairpin. Um, hmm. I'm not saying that women are obsessed with hairpins, but I'm just saying like if anybody's gonna buy one, or auction one, it's probably gonna be a you know a woman who takes pride in you know beauty and you know fashion. So, makes sense. Marhaban, assalamu alaikum. Yasas, ni hao. Hello. It is the time of year again to fulfill your deepest yearning, to listen to your heart's desire and purchase what God has shown us. It brings me great joy to welcome all of you esteemed individuals to our annual Dairat al-Mal. First on our exclusive captivating list of exotic odds and ends, we have a stunning statue from India. Made of ivory and crafted by the finest artisans, it will be a perfect addition to any home. Oh, hmm. what do we have? One bidder already. No, two. Calling once, twice, a third. Would anyone like to best that price? No? So, this piece goes to the lovely lady. Next, we have a one-of-a-kind ethereal beauty. This hairpin hails from the east. And look at the detail on the dragon. Perfect as a collectible, and even better as a gift for a certain lady friend you might have. So, so what is this piece worth to you, Ya Azdekhai? One, for the treasurer who graced us with her presence. Ning, the treasurer. Two. Any others? Hmm. We have a third there. Ho! Oh, two owns it again. Number three, what will you do? How much do you want this, my friends? Reach into your heart. Listen to your desire. Hmm. No one? Then sold to the handsome bearded man. This hairpin belongs to you now, Saidi. Now, for the third item. Oh, she hot. She hot. And we thank you once again for making the Dairatul Mal a success. May your purses be ever full and your heart ever longing. All right. I think it took some of our money, though. But it's all good. It is all good. Because we can steal it from other people. Her calmness, her grace, like a long, shiny star against a dark night. If only I could speak to her. All right. Yeah, she over there standing. She acting like the Ming is some kind of Beyonce. Oh, did you see her? How she rode in on that horse. <laughs> All right. Let me see if we can go ahead and get this treasurer talking to us. Move aside. Apologies. My instructions were clear. No brooch, no entry. Do you know who I am? I need to speak to the treasurer. I was called, summoned. Now let me talk to him. Assalamu alaikum. I'm here to see the treasurer. On what business? I have a gift for the treasurer, if she will see me. Only members of the ivory coin are allowed to enter. No brooch, no entry. All right, so this door is barred. Um. Oh wait, I think there's somebody down there that we can talk to. I didn't see that before. Who is this guy? Hmm. 
Is this a woman? Proof that I am of the Merchant's Guild. Look, see. With respect, that does not entitle you to three bags of saffron, two of vanilla, and a bottle of honey without a single coin. Impossible. Bah! This is a waste of my time. Hello, spices for you. Trouble with customers. No more than usual. These people from the Ivory Coin think themselves touched by God himself. The Ivory Coin? I... I should not speak about it. I do not know much, really. Hmm... Damn, they done took a lot of my money, so I'm gonna go ahead and offer Whatever a bribe. Whatever you know can help me. Well, it will not hurt to tell you what I know. The Ivory Coin is an exclusive merchant's guild. They have a brooch that grants access to certain places. How do you obtain this brooch? I hear only respected merchants are part of the Ivory Coin, and that you can only be invited by another member. They think their status gives them permission to take goods without coin. <laughs> Have you ever seen such vanity? This is expected in Karch. Thank you. All right, I gotta go to the guild to get the coin. And it's a good thing I was grinding with all these missions to get this stuff because, man, it would have. They'd have. No brooch, no entry. Got me bone dry. Yes, but I left my brooch in there. Do you not see the problem here? No brooch, no entry. Lanakallah. Okay, so it looks like he he's not gonna allow us to go through that way. So we're gonna have to figure out a way to get up there without without him knowing it. I think. Uh, let's head out this way. Oh, what the hell is she doing? Go up that way. Ah, come on. Maybe around this side. this damn it's not gonna go up there I thought for sure they allow me to climb this okay there we go in a restricted area. So let's come down from here. An exclusive union for the merchants of high society. I should have expected this to exist. The Chamber of Antiquities is the treasurer's haven. I need to find a way in. I do not care what you have to do. Burn them or murder their dogs if you have to. Understood, sir. We will retrieve your coin from the merchant stall on the morrow, at all cost. Why not today? Yeah. You lot are getting more incompetent by the day. Useless. Hey, uh, sure, sure. Uh, the Sahib will skin us if we slack hey. off. Huh. If there is a problem, we will be ready. What? 
There we go. Took care of them. This must be the ivory coin's brooch. Shiny. I have both trinkets. The guard will have to let me in now. Exactly. Try to get some more money. Oh, we got gears too. And leather. Let's just back out of here. Uh, I'll, I'll go out the other way because I don't want him thinking, like, where the hell did he come from? Even though I don't even think the game would even do that. I think the game would just be, just completely ignore the fact that I just came from a different location. Hey, where the hell did these guys come from? They weren't here before. Weird. Let's see. Alright, cool. All right, let's just move around to the other side. Nobody saw that. All right, so now we got what we need to get an audience with the treasurer. And then that's when we kill them. It's been a fun little mission, man. I'm not gonna lie. You know, it's a different change of pace. Instead of like, you know, trying to infiltrate a fortress or a building or, or some kind of, you know, structure. We just pretended to be regular citizens. Auctioning off for a hairpin. All right, so now he got to let us in. Assalamu alaikum. You again. What is it now? I have something that she wants. A Chinese hairpin from the auction. I also have my brooch with me here. Very well. You may enter. Nice. This way, Sayyidi. I have been looking forward to meeting the treasurer. It is an honor. Indeed, Sayyidi. She is busy, and her time only allows for a few rare appearances. I have never seen so many treasures in one place. I don't know why they give me the option to assassinate right now, because it would be terrible to do that now. I swear it. Treasurer, Ning, if only you go. Leave the box. Forget the plague out of my sight. If I have to talk, nothing here for you. Oh. Well, I guess we gotta kill everybody in here. Please refrain well, I... from speaking about the treasurer inappropriately. You may enter. Okay, so we gotta wait. That's all we had to do. Cause I was about to throw some, throw some hands. All right, so let me interact. You are a new face. My name is Basim. New to Baghdad, but not to trade. I deal mostly in fine antiques and collectibles. You must have a good eye for detail then. What have you brought me, Basim? You know what I brought. A man not to be toyed with. Come, show it to me. Oh, baby. Yeah, you had the right idea, player. Exquisite. Ever seen something like this? So perfect. So delicate. No, but I am surprised that you have not. I do have a pension for them. When I was but a child, 
My sisters and I would tie our hair with sticks, adorn them with stone. I pretended they were the rarest gems. We had nothing, but we felt that we had it all. There are many reasons why people see me. For advice, a taste of power, and most often, to win favor. Why have you come, Basim? As a fellow collector, I have heard much about you from others. Your extravagance, your taste. I wish to learn- Did they say I was lucky? I loathe the word. When I first arrived in Baghdad, I was one of many seeking my fortune. Now, I have even the East wrapped around my fingers. I clawed my way here where many gave up, preferring to spare their nails. But me? I don't mind a few scratches, a bit of blood. Surely there have been connections. The people you met that helped you get to where you are. No matter what others say, you only have yourself. No one else. Mm. Everything prospers when family is harmonious. Family? The word has no meaning. The notions, even more so. Only the self hears the deepest whispers of your soul and accepts you whole. No one lives alone. But we die lonely. In the end, we are absolutely, simply, truly, Alone. Turn to the bureau. To the treasurer. Oh shoot! He's dead. What? The ghost! Help! Damn you! Did someone killed. Treasurer. Follow my lead. Ah shit! I was trying to do the autofocus. Get out of here. 
Let's skedaddle. I'm looking so guilty right now, running. I probably shouldn't run. Let's not run. All right. Now let's run. <laughs> All right, let's uh, make our way across this river. Couldn't think of the word. Scale up this building. Ah, come on. Yeah, it's this way. Okay. I thought it was this way. Here we go. Let's tell him the good news. Basim, how did you fare? The streets are alive with talk about the auction. Rumors spread quickly. It was this woman, Ning. A woman holding the reins. She must have angered many. Angered and enthralled, in equal parts. It is no wonder she kept her identity hushed. Now the upper echelons of affluent louts are soiling their silk robes, wondering if they are next. The order will not stop here. If they have reached the east, then there is no telling how far they will spread. Did you see it? The Jenny? It... Uh, it is gone now. It is gone. Rest while you can. Our work is not done yet. All right, so we ranked up to uh, Disciple. I was about to say Discipline. <laughs> we ranked up to uh, Disciple. All right, so I'm going to pause the game. right. I'm going to stop the game right there, and we'll pick it up at another time. This game is really fun, man. I'm really enjoying myself. I think the story is amazing. Um, I'm really loving how everything is paced. Um, you know, just when I think that they've pretty much done every aspect of, us, you, know, you know, the Assassin's Creed, uh genre um they just keep building and making it better all right but no uh no need to further extend it out so i'm gonna stop it right here if you haven't subscribed please subscribe think consider consider subscribing uh leave a like if you enjoyed the gameplay comment and i will see you guys later peace